Hello students and welcome to Craft Corner. This week's theme is fall, even though it doesn't feel like fall, uh, but we are going to be doing some fall crafts. Maybe if we do these fall crafts, we'll make fall the weather change and it'll feel more like fall. These are both, I, I'm very, really impressed with these. Uh, these are actually pretty practical. You can use one for decoration and you can use one for wildlife. We'll get to that in a minute. So inside your packet, you have some, one of these. It could be a, maybe a different fall color, but this one's gold. And also in your packet, you have some letters. The letter A isn't cut out. If you want to cut it out like I did, you can. Just the center of the A isn't cut out. And you have a leaf and the letters to spell the word fall. And you have two strings in there. And for this activity, we're gonna use the skinnier white string. And you should also have a little wooden dowel. All right, so the first thing you're gonna do is decide what you want your design to look like on your banner. This is a fall banner. It's always good to lay it out first that you know you have all the letters in order before you glue them down. And you can do it any way you want. You can do it across, you can have the F down here, the A up here, one of the L's down here, one of the other L's, however you want to do it. And then you just take the glue, your school glue, which you can get at the Dollar Tree. By now you should have glue knowing that we send these every week and we usually need glue. And you're just going to glue down all your letters and your leaf. You may have a different colored leaf too. I think there's about three or four variations of leaves from gold to red. And you're just going to glue down all your letters. After you glue down your letters, you're going to take the dowel, you're going to go through the back side, across the front, and through the other hole, you're going to go through there and go to the back side. And there you go. Now you can, it depends on if you want the look of the stick, which is really nice, or if you don't want to see the stick, you just do it opposite. You start on top, go around the back, and then through. So one way you can see the stick going across, and the other way you can. And then after you're done, you just take the string and you tie it on both ends. And you may need a little drop of glue to keep it because it's going to slide. You can glue it or tape it, and when you're done, it looks like, and they, the girls taped it, it looks like this. And you can hang it in your room or on your front door. It's your fall banner. All right, now it's time for our second craft, and this one also benefits birds that are outside. So it's fun to do, and it's helpful to watch to the birds. So we we went around all over Fresno and we collected some pine cones. So you have a pine cone and you have a little container of seed and you have a little container of peanut butter. Put something down because it's going to be a little bit messy. So you take your oh and you also have the fa the fatter string. So you take your pine cone, get a butter knife or a plastic knife. You can even use your fingers. And you're going to take the peanut butter and you're going to smear it on the tops of all of the sure what they call the pieces, the parts of the pine cone that sticks out, but it almost looks like a Christmas tree, so you would be wiping it on what would be the branches of the Christmas tree, 
and don't worry about the ones that are way inside. You're gonna to wanna to get the ones that are up toward the outside. And it gives you a flat surface so that you can then glue. This is, instead of using our spool glue, this is the glue that we're gonna to use to glue down our bird seed and it tastes good because the birds wouldn't want to eat glue plus it wouldn't be safe. So after you're finished, you take your bird seed and you're going to sprinkle it. I would take pinches of it, don't just try to pour it over. And you're going to sprinkle it on the peanut butter. Okay. You just do that all the way around, sprinkle it all on your peanut butter. Then when you're done, you're gonna tie your string to the top of your pine cone. And when you're finished, you will have this. And you can hang it in a tree or on your patio or somewhere where the birds can see it. And then you have a natural bird feeder. And that's it for this time. We'll see you next time. Bye.